So now let's see how we can work with reading skill inside of Adobe Captivate. So to work with reading skill, first of all, you have to be sure that you're on a static blank project like this and not a responsive project like this because responsive projects does not support reading skills. So you can see that by going on to the slides right over here and then by going on to question slides and here you can see that rating scale is disabled for a responsive project. But for a regular static project, it will be enabled. So you can go to slide right over here and then you can go to question slide and there you go, there's the rating scale. So I'm just going to add in two rating scale right here. So unlike other questions, you don't have an option to make it graded because rating scales are usually used for surveys anyways. So I'm just going to press OK right over here. So once I do that, you can see that there's two rating scale and you have these items right over here. So you can go to the quiz section and you can choose the number of answers. So you can do like two right over here and there's two uh, M answers right over here, three, then three. You can type in the item, let's say for example, food uh, and then let's say for example, hospitality and then let's uh, go over here, price and so forth. So you can have a rating right here. Whatever else you have, like other ratings, you can add in, in another rating scale right over here. You can add more than uh, three right over here as well, but for that you need a bigger canvas. So you need to go to uh, modify and rescale out the project so it, it can fit more. But over here, if I were to do four answers, then you can see that it is just hidden right over here, uh, just like that. It is hidden out here. So if I were to do four and enter, you can see that a uh, little, um, submission area is there, but um, it is not seen right over here. So you can have as many reading skills as you want, but you need to increase your canvas size accordingly as well. In this default, only three is there, just like this. So that is how you can work around with reading skills. And over here uh, on the right side, you can see the reading scale right now by default is five. You can do around two or three. Uh, something like that according to what you want. So you can see that food is bad uh, and let's say for example neutral and over here you can write something like excellent right over here. Okay, so three rating skills right over here. So if I were to preview this out right over here, preview the project, let's see how we can work around with this. So saving the file as you can see and previewing the project. So there's our blank slide, which is actually playing first. And then we have this. So we can choose like a rating right over here and submit it out right over here. We can choose a rating out here and submit it out. You won't actually see it in the results space right over here, but you'll see it in your learning management system right over there where you collect the data for um, like what the response was from the participants. So this is how you can work with the rating scale or like it inside of Adobe Captivate. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.